Sidewalks and curbs for twenty-six thousand dollars. Second. Seconded by Mr. Pluff. And though it's flat, I do have a problem with this. Line I have item. a problem questions with that so as forth. well. Uh, you want to give us a sidewalk spiel before I ask any questions? Or? <laughs> we took this twenty-six thousand. We combined it with a warrant article that I believe was like forty-five thousand. Yeah. We got done handicap ramps and sidewalks replaced on High Street in the Marston School area. Down in front of Flatbread Pizza, um, trying to think of the other areas, but it was predominantly in that area. We bid it out twice, uh, tried to bid it out twice. We got one bidder. We expended all the money on, I mean, sidewalks and handicap ramps. Okay, so when we're looking at this budget book, we see you spent basically two thousand dollars out of a twenty-six thousand dollars line item. It's but it's not a fair consideration. Because you've got to couple that with the one article for forty-five thousand. Correct, and it all has an spending the one article uh -huh. money first. Uh, we had to we married them both together and spent it as one sum. Well, you seem to be spending them first because you've got a lot percentage-wise a lot left in this line item. Uh, Not that much as the forty-five thousand, I think. Last time should I be all expended by now. I assume your your one article oh. is close to depleted at this point, or not? What's the status on that one article fund, Christy? I'm looking right now. Thank you. Yeah, it's a. So, uh, Here we go. I have a, I have a, while we wait for that answer, I have another question. Uh, I know SAU 90 was attempting to, to throw week, money at you to do sidewalks. So, this is 26. Um, oh, it's still present. Did they actually throw money at you? Did, they, did you actually right. take no. possession of money? We took their scope of work and our scope of work and tried to combine it under one bid to attract right. more yeah. bidders. To a what right. would be a much larger contract, yeah. more profitable for them. But my only but question is whether or not you have received money from them. No. no. Okay. No. And I know that you've been not being able to spend all the money on sidewalks, the budget, and the Warren article because of the bidding problem. The ability. Well, to no. Keep my money. understanding is all the sidewalk money is gone. Period. Yeah. It, or will be gone by the end of the year. We had an eighty um, or ninety thousand dollar contract with them. Oh, really? It's gone. So all of this money here is gone as well? It's gone. Okay. This Good. is the... Now, one final question. Last year when we... Tim, wait a minute. Hold on. This is the end October, and it shows nothing expended out of sidewalks, the 45000 What are we I missing? I don't have the Jamco construction contract in front of me, but it ate up all the money. And Jennifer, if she was here tonight, and okay. Well, I just want to ask, Christy. We it's showing nothing on the October. Yeah, we bid it, okay. contracted it, and it's it's. It's it probably that just hasn't been invoiced yet. Okay. And one one final question on the sidewalks, Chris. Uh, last year, I asked the, the the big thing was let's get ADA compliant. Mm -hmm. And my question was. What's the plan to get the entire town ADA compliant right. sidewalk wise? And you said there was no plan, that you were going to devise a plan. No, Jennifer. And I'm basically has... asking the question is how is the status of that plan coming? Jennifer has like 50 sites. Okay. Give me 200,000 and I'll really get a, a dent in it. But I mean, no, I'm not asking the actual yeah. work, but the plan <laughs> in terms of you're going to fund it over 10 years, five she's years. Got, you know. as, as the money is there, she's identified 50. Handicap ramps around town and hundreds of feet of sidewalk. The uh -huh. whole Ave is all scheduled for repair. Uh -huh. um, there's there's any number. Literally, the list would baffle you. So I, I didn't hear anything last night about uh, a warrant article for sidewalks, did I? <laughs> I don't believe we were asked about one last night for sidewalks. Is there one coming? Who knows? Or do you anticipate one? They're not telling us. Are you requesting one? Are you suggesting one? <laughs> well, uh, uh, yes, we did. We did okay. discuss the sidewalk grant, now that I'm thinking out loud about it. Uh, One million dollars. That was the SAU 90 uh, proposal to go after a federal grant. Safe right? streets. Right. Under the safe streets, there's a grant program that would give us 800000 of the million we ask for. Mm -hmm. uh, we stand second in line in the county mm -hmm. by just one or two points yeah. from a difference from a project in, I think, Exeter. Mm -hmm. That still all had to, has to go up to the DOT. They make the final decision. It has to do with number of kids eating school lunches and other miscellaneous things, and they will decide. And, right. it, it, and So we're basically leaning on that to get our sidewalks done next year. At least to give a good hit. Is that right, Fred? Yes. 
a very small portion. Yeah. I mean, it, okay. It's a it's a million dollars. We're committing two hundred thousand theoretically, right? If we get it, that's going to go a long way to taking care of the whole town, I assume. A lot of it, correct? Uh, yes. Precise. But if it doesn't go, if we don't get the grant, and we don't raise the money, and all we got in the budget is twenty six thousand okay. dollars, what's the condition of our sidewalk improvement then? We'll go the first fifty feet we can go. Yeah. Fifty feet. Fifty feet. <laughs> Being facetious. Chris, I have a question. How? When is the last time we sealed the concrete sidewalk? Maybe not too facetious. Last we are sealing the, the sidewalks as we're the new ones as Concrete. we're putting them in. For instance, the sidewalks that were done around here. Yeah. Uh, Al, Joan, oh no, Charlie Butchock and Johnny O'Brien. Thank you. Came in here on Fridays when their afternoons when there was no activity at the city clerk's office and did it. Mm -hmm. And I know I also also authorized them. They worked on a Sunday mm -hmm. and finished sealing with Thompson's water seal all the sidewalks. How about the sidewalks? The sidewalks at the beach with that infrastructure no. project and stuff. Nothing's been sealed? Years after the sidewalks are in, it's <laughs> a waste of expenditure of good Too taxpayer late. money to try and seal something that's already weathered. So we're the program is seal them after you put them in. Janko's contract has them responsible for sealing what they put in this year. This is going to be recent because in my recollection we haven't sealed concrete sidewalks. In the past, correct, we have not. How long does that sealing last when they do it? It's supposed to be once a year, I think, once they put it. I'd have to read Three up years. on the literature. Years, yeah, years. I would say a couple. I think what it really has to do with is um, the amount of foot traffic, uh, the scalings, uh, yeah. where it gets, and, and also how much chemical yeah. salt matter gets put on it. And I have one other one other quick query. The sidewalk on High Street from Five Corners to 1A. Mm -hmm. Don Muxie's daughter was out running in January evening in the dark, and she got killed. She was hit by a car and killed. And after that, there was great ruckus to add a sidewalk yeah. in that area from, high, from uh, Five Corners to 1A. <clears throat> and several hundred thousand dollars and it has the ramps and people run and walk in the road they don't use the sidewalk that much so i don't know how helpful this ramp stuff is but my experience since i live in the area is that after that was constructed people chose to run in the street let brian um well Fred is here. Uh -oh. I'll open this up. What are we missing or what are we lacking in our bids? Because I kept hearing last night, yeah. you know, everything was one bid, maybe two. Well, it was one and I think they had three. But constantly it was one bid, one bid. And like you would say, tell ten and you got one bid. Is there something we're not doing or looking at? It, no. I, it bugs me, you know, do we have to keep right. changing from the three or more? I, I really don't think so. For instance, um, like one of the bids that came in last night was a chemical bid. Mm -hmm. Polymer for at the wastewater treatment plant. To be honest with you, we actually take samples of polymer and test them to see how they work on our particular sludge. Mm -hmm. And then we advertise the bid for that particular chemical. So of the five chemical companies we sell it to, they may not actually be dealing in that, that one particular chemical. So it's a specialized so in that case, bid. You're right. Yeah. So you can, now, they could choose to start handling that chemical, but I think mm -hmm instead of the 100,000 gallons that we might need in a year, and I'm speaking of a hypothetical number, I think they'd, they'd be more interested in handling a million because the yeah. profit margin would be better on a million. Yeah. Um, yeah. I'm doing a fence bid right now. I sent it to five people. I got my three responses. Um, some of them, the, for a number of vendors, the economy is good. They have enough work. I, you know, they look at, I'm not going to spend my Friday night 
or my Saturday putting together a bid when probably so and so down the road is going to outbid me, and that's that's the climate. Right. Yeah. If if people were hungrier, I think you'd see more participation. Uh, one of the other things that we do do, uh, two things. It's a state law. If the contract's higher than thirty-five thousand, you have to have a performance bond to protect the public. So that will dissuade a medium-sized contractor. We also, to protect the town, require liability insurance, proof of uh, that they've got. Uh, the fancy terms uh, it always comes down liability and loss. Loss. Yeah. Yeah. right we're yeah. still asking over two million exactly yeah. mm -hmm. and and and, bec and you know you could ask selectman <coughs> Dean that's that's those are the going levels of insurance yeah. now the big insurance uh, to Jamco that's not a problem mm -hmm. they, they, they carry five and ten millions but to one horse truck construction company mm -hmm. nothing no, no. yeah good good question it, 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 it dissuades them from bidding yeah. so there's some factors in there so we can't eliminate those factors because it wouldn't protect you the taxpayers mm -hmm. if this, to, to allow other people in if you will to bid okay so you guys ready for 26,000 sidewalks and curbs in favor okay Unanimous, my goodness. Man.